So for the last few days, I think most of the engineers were in constant wait by the for the final update by UPSC regarding to the rescheduling of engineering services 2025 examination since they had already hinted that it is going to be rescheduled but there was no clarity on the date so yes okay today 18th of October UPSC has come up with the final update okay for the engineering service 2025 not only about the date of examination but also about the application window okay you know when will the fresh wind application window open because IRMS now you know, IRMS now recruiting, uh, you know, for the stores, okay, civil, electrical, mechanical and signal and telecommunication through ESC 2025 is making students lot, you know, lot excited about this examination because railways was always a charm of, you know, UPSC engineering services examination and due to this now many more aspirants who have not filled up the form, they are looking forward to fill up the form and a very big news is earlier the engineering services prelims was on 9th February, scheduled on 9th February 2025 but it's postponed as i told you in the last video that it is expected to be somewhere around may june that is what i was expecting at least april but i mostly told may or june it's going to be okay and yes the date is somewhere around that what is that date let's look into the complete notification so if you go to the upsc website under the engineering services examination okay you have the addendum okay that has been added today okay to reflect the changes uh, you know that is going to be there. So once you click to it, the complete document will open. Okay, so anyways, I've opened that document separately. Let's highlight the important points in this particular video. Okay, so yeah, okay, as you are able to see, this uh, notification is dated 18th of October. That is just today. Okay, and uh, yeah, this is uh, the this is in line with you know uh, with the earlier update on 8th of October because the uh, uh, the complete notification earlier came on 18 september okay the last date of filling up the form was 8th october and the update actually came on 5th of october okay that irms okay for civil mechanical electrical signal telecommunication and store okay will be will be will be will be through the recruitment to these categories will be through engineering services 2025 okay now due to which some you know additional changes have been done so have a look into it what was the original window 18 september notification came and the last date was 8th of october as i mentioned and 9th of october correction window was supposed to start for one week 9 to 15th october okay now what is the new application window that means if you by chance miss to fill the form or if you were not filling the form th that time okay uh, because your major goal was uh, you know uh, railways and now you are going to look up to fill up the form okay yes you can also fill up even fresh candidates are allowed okay so uh, 18th of october that is just today okay today from today the application window starts and you have considerable and sufficient time it is going to be there till 22nd of november i repeat 22nd of november enough time is there and the revised correction window will be 23rd november to 29th of november Okay, so there will be a correction window also in case if you do any any mistakes or any corrections you need to do it in your form. Okay, so this is the combined window for new applicants and also enabling old ones to make changes. Okay, we'll talk more about this point as well. So have a look into it. See what they are trying to tell if you have already applied. Okay, if you have already applied, look into this important point. Okay, then you need not want to apply again. But if you have applied and you have, by chance did some mistake and you want you were looking to correct it. Okay, so the correction window for the old applicants is from today, okay, till 22nd November and also from 23rd to 29th. Okay, that means, okay, those who want to fill the fresh form, okay, those who want to fill the fresh form, okay, they can do it from 18th October to 22nd of November and their correction window will be from 23rd to 29th. But those who have already filled up the form, okay, their correction window will be of course 23rd to 29th also, but their correction window is from today to 22nd November also okay i hope you have got it okay so majorly this is you know a big update for you know fresh candidates those who are looking to fill up the form they did not fill earlier okay so 18th october to 22nd of november if you are old aspirants and if you want to correct your form starting from today up to 29 november this big window you have for any editing or any correction in the form you would like to do okay same point has been you know mentioned here okay okay the the form will be 22nd uh, till 22nd november till 6 pm okay now the following shall be inserted okay because already in the earlier notification okay what departments okay uh, you know will be uh, participating in the recruitment uh, you know for civil mechanical electrical and electronics telecommunication were mentioned in the earlier notification this will be inserted okay these are the departments that are going to be interest, uh, you know inserted in the list of participating services okay so irms indian railway management services and uh, for civil and for stores okay because stores 20 vacancies are there for the stores okay the bifurcation of 20 vacancies is not mentioned civil mechanical electrical electronics 
all can you know get you know any of and all can get this stores total 20 bifurcation they will mention later okay mechanical irms for mechanical and irms stores okay for electrical irms electrical and irms store similarly for electronics and telecommunication irms signal and telecommunication okay and irms stores okay will be added up okay uh, these are what is again mentioned here okay now coming to a very very important point that you might be eyeing sir what is finally the date of examination this is the big update okay that i think most you are looking for okay and that is the date of the exam let me write it very clear okay it is june as i told you know it, it's expected to be in may and june it is june guys gate exam gets over by mid february okay so march april may june four extra months Okay, now there could be two, three reasons why aspirant were not filling the engineering services form. One was of course railway. So now you have railway back with 225 vacancies. With the addition of railway, 225 vacancies, the total vacancies for this year is 457. Okay, because earlier 232 vacancies were released, 225 is IRMS vacancies. Okay, 232 were the early, in the earlier notification. Okay, so total 457. Okay, it's a big number. Okay, and... Uh, Yes, guys, four additional months. So what I was telling, some students may be not filling up the form because of railway was not there. Now railway is there and some students not filling up the form because they think they are not much prepared for gate also. How they can parallelly prepare extra syllabus of ESC. So many aspirants have this thought. Okay, first, let us write down gate one year. Then we will try ESC next year because ESC is also falling in the month of February. Okay, parallelly many students cannot manage, especially those who are preparing for the first time. It is hard to manage. Droppers, repeaters can manage. But now even if you are a fresher, going to write the gate for first time focus only and only only and only on gate till your exam date okay whether your exam is on the first weekend or the third weekend of february okay i don't know whether gate will change the date as per usc but let's say the gate is in first and third weekend of february okay prepare only on only on gate and extra four months i think is a big enough amount of time okay to prepare for the prelims okay it's only prelims okay of course the only thing i would say is ki now for mains you will not get enough gap Earlier for you know, between pre and mains around you know four five months of gap was generated, but now it will not be four five months. Maybe roughly two months of gap will be there. But don't worry. Once you write down the prelims, you get an idea whether you are going to get the cutoff of cutoff qualified or not. So you start preparing for mains accordingly. And anyways, for mains, main thing is conventional practice. Okay, the syllabus remains the technical syllabus remains to be same, but way of presenting the answer and conventional test series that is what plays a major role. So guys, four extra months after the gate examination, I think it's a big opportunity. Okay, so I think many of, I think most of the gate aspirants should write on, should write on this examination now. Okay, because even you did not think in any direction with respect to engineering services, four additional months can make you easily prepare about the non-tech syllabus as well and about the extra technical syllabus as well. So take this opportunity, okay, and do your very, very best. And the biggest thing is right now you can only focus on the gate. No deviations here, only pure focus on gate. That makes your gate also, gate preparation also more sound and later on you can target engineering services as well. And you must try, you should give it a try unless and until you are very clear that you have to, you know, this time you have to go see. Of course, there will be students dedicated only for, you know, uh, going to IIC Bangalore or IIT Bombay. Okay, but if you think, okay, this can be your cup of tea, okay, being, you know, selected as a class one group, a gadgeted officer, that itself is an honor. Okay, then you should definitely try this year. Don't wait for the next year. Okay, bye-bye. Thank you. Stay safe and all the very, very best for both GATE as well as Engineering Services Examination.